Time now for Don Spotlight. It's so good to come into a collegiate system as like an outsider but see a lot of potential in the team and especially from a team that hasn't historically done that well. We're like an underdog in every single race we go into. It's quite a young team. I almost like the fact that they're working really hard. They've brought in four British guys and we all know that if we keep on working we can be one of the most successful teams this school's had. It was nice knowing that potentially I could have three like, British boys with me and that was a big thing because I mean obviously going this far away from home especially on my own would have been quite daunting. I literally came in was quite nervous was a bit like unsure moving to a different country and then the whole team were just so driven to be good. It's almost unheard of like completely the facilities what we're doing every day you would not get that at home. I live fairly out in the country at home but I love city it's just the, like the vibe and the atmosphere that's going on everyone's got somewhere to go somewhere to be and it's just like an energy that you can kind of feed off. It's like living in a postcard you go around you see the bridge you see the sunset in the morning it's like living in a film walking around every day which is good. It's the whole new experience I'm just experiencing what I'm getting out of it I'm enjoying every minute of it. Here, the team is like outstandingly the number one consideration. We've sacrificed a lot to be here, and I think with the effort we're putting in, I think we all know how good we can be, and I, want to, I think we all want to get to that level. We've got some really talented guys on the team who, like, with the right commitment, with the right training, could like come together and form a really, really competitive team. We have the British pride a little bit when it comes to training. None of us want to lose to each other, and, but it's healthy, like it's healthy because it pushes us. It doesn't matter who comes in first in the team, who comes in last, just as long as each one of us goes out, like throws our heart into the performance, gets to the finish line and completely collapses. That's got to be the core ingredient for a team because that, that kind of competitiveness brings out the best in everyone else. I'm very competitive and I love winning. Coming down the finishing line with the crowds, I mean, you just feed off that kind of energy and that kind of adrenaline is amazing. We'd like to welcome you to the broadcast. This is the 30th Roy Griek Invitational. It's time to earn some Colas points, make a statement. Our team was like really, really excited to go to Griek because we knew it was going to be sort of a big occasion. It was the first time we'd be able to put out what we think at the moment is our strongest squad. And basically just to see how we stack up against some other very competitive teams in the nation. Set. Go. The size of it, the professionalism of it, was just mind-boggling for me. If you get yourself into a good position and you really do a good job from 5K to 7K, that's where the race is going to be determined. And there's still a bunch of athletes packed together. It is separating ever so slightly. Another team that I noticed has one or two runners in that top pack is USF. I spoke with Helen and she said you have to look out for our men's team. That is the team that's going to stand out this year. Overall the meet was a really good learning curve for us because we know now what it's going to take to beat some of them top teams. I mean at one point all five of us were in that lead pack and it might not have finished that way but the fact is that we put ourselves in that position. If we want to be conference champions, if we want to go to the nationals and mix it with the best in, in the US. Every time you get on the start line for a race, you've got to be buzzing. You've got to be like, like jumping at the chance to, to race against these guys. And I know everyone in the team is, I certainly am. I can't wait to go out and mix it with the big teams that we've heard about. I can't wait to go out and show them what USF is made of. One, two, three, does!